Hey everyone, welcome. This is Ben Sullins from Pluralsight, and I want to welcome you here to a preview of my latest course, Data Analytics Hands-On. Now in this course, I take you through everything that is the world of data analytics. Some of the goals are learning all the basics, everything you'd need to know to be a competent data analyst. We also go through and build some functional examples, so you don't leave it just understanding theory. You have practical skills that you can demonstrate and use in your job or in the new job you're trying to find. We also follow a story. I think it's really important for us to relate to something. So I introduce this company, Cogsley Services, and I'll tell you about that in just a second. Now, this course is designed with kind of two methods of learning in mind. So one is this start to finish. So if you're new to the idea of data analytics, maybe it's a field you want to get into, or maybe it's something that you're already in, or maybe just barely getting into, and you just want to use this as a reference. Either way, you can use it as a start to finish or a place to fill in the gaps. Each module is designed with four basic topics in mind, the what, the why, the how, and the where. We go through what it is, whatever the subject is for the module, we talk about why it is, why you'd use it, why it exists, or anything like that. I show you how, so this is where we get into that functional piece. And lastly, in every module, I'll show you where you can find more info. So that way, if you do want to dig in deeper, you know exactly where to go. So data analytics, just like many other fields, is one where there is an entire world of things and avenues for you to explore a career path or really dive in and just fall in love with a certain area. So this course introduces you to everything, so that way you can find what that path is for you and then you can dive in deeper. So in the skills that we're gonna learn here, we talk about Excel. This is a fundamental skill that I think most people maybe already have, or if you haven't, this is the key piece that you need to be able to use when becoming a data analyst. And I think that's true because it's kind of like gardening. Excel is getting your hands dirty, working with the data by hand. And having that understanding is incredibly valuable as you progress through the more advanced ways of working with your data. We also get into SQL. This is a programming language, the structured query language as it is, to understand how to work with data universally across all database systems, understand SQL. And that is fundamental. So if you know these two things, you're in really good hands. Then we get into databases, what they are, data warehousing. We look at choosing chart types and understanding when we visualize data, when we're trying to tell a story, what chart types are appropriate for what types of data. And then we go into Tableau, which is this data visualization platform that has really dominated the analytics world in the past several years. So I show you some functional examples of all these areas here. Lastly, we wrap it up with presentation design. This is a key piece. I think understanding how to design presentations is the final step in communicating and telling your story and conveying meaning to your audience. So our story, the one I mentioned before, is Cogsley Services. This is a fictitious company that I use throughout the course as examples that are real world scenarios that you are either probably already in or may encounter in your career and help lay that foundation so you have a reference point of why we're doing something or where it fits in this world. Cognitive Services is a startup that was founded in 2008. They've seen tremendous growth in this technical services sector, but they're having a hard time pulling their data together and analyzing it. Sound familiar? That's the idea. So we want to go through this and learn how to work with Cognitive Services and how to help them overcome this, which essentially is the process of data analytics. I'll talk about the analytics cycle and how it's this never-ending loop of acquiring, exploring, visualizing, testing, and studying data, and how you can jump from one piece to the other, all the while learning and understanding things that you never even thought you had questions about, gaining ways of looking at your data and looking at your business to act upon them and improve things. We'll talk about how it works and how data comes from basically several different types of places. It flows into a back office system, jumps into the front office system. This is known as data warehousing. From there is when you really get the value out of it and you start doing these types of things like targeting customers, monitoring your business, or making more strategic decisions. And we'll look at all the different categories here, the providers of data, the warehousing of data, and the use cases. This is this whole world here, and there are a thousand things to consider. And I'm going to get you through all of those to where you have a basic understanding of what's what. So I hope this is exciting for you. I hope you want to dive into the world of data analytics. Come on this fun journey with me, and let's learn some things.